Hello Wolfpack, and welcome to Alchemy with Wolf. Today, we're creating something super de duper special. Mmm. Once I add this ingredient to my bubbling cauldron, I will have created the perfect human being. No more will humanity have flaws. No more will we suffer with disease and imperfection. Let's create. Yes. In all these months of searching, I still can't find the hidden relic. This last soul thinks her twigs and roots will let her dabble in worlds beyond our own. She has no idea what she is meddling with. Well, we're gonna be dealing with some ritualistic crap in here. Cool. Cool, cool, cool. We are literally in a witch's home. A witch lives here. Some horrible, demonic witch who is apparently brewing a potion. Uh, this is not smart. Oh, God. Uh, huh? A moon symbol. Ew. A lot of different symbols. They each drop different gunk. That's gross. Got a bird cage here. Guess we'll do some exploring first. Ah, a letter. The Watcher arrives, blind to their master's shadow, even as the rot of deceit rises off them like a thousand burning embers. He deceives them with his promises, but he does not deceive me. What I want, he won't give willingly. The ritual is laid out. I offer freedom. He won't even offer death. So the witch wrote this, and she is clearly talking. What was that? It's like a weird roar. Um, and she's talking about the craftsman, who is just not a good guy, as I've suspected all along. Oh, there's the witch, dropping crap into her big potion. Great. Good. Wonderful. Happy to be here. Uh, ooh, got a nice fire. Ah, uh, I'm really glad I wear these gloves because I would not want to touch anything otherwise. What is this? Little candle holders. What is? Hmm. I don't know what that does. Oh, that's how you put out the fire. Got it. A fire lighter. This is it like a Harry Potter wand? Uh, Flameo. Do I have to light it? Oh. Light the candles. Do I have to then put this down? And let them be lit. There we go. There we go. Boom. Uh-huh. Oh. Bell. Open fire. Fire with the thing. So this up. This closed. Ooh. An ornate glass jar. And an inscribed metal cube. Oh, whoa. What? Oh. That's weird. Got it. And I got a jar. I'm guessing that goes with the symbols that were on the goop machine over there. Let's keep exploring a little bit. There is a tree here in the middle. Get out of here. 
And there's like a gap in the tree, but I can't see anything that's going to get me in there. Huh. Nothing. Another moon symbol. There's a few moon symbols, and here's a moon. Oh, and I can change it. All right, what is this moon symbol? It looks like, like that. Oh, yeah, and it kind of changes it here. All right, that'll probably come into play at some point. What is this? Uh, huh? A lot of weird symbols in a box. Interesting. And that does nothing. So we're missing something for that. All right, let's go back to the goop machine. I think that's everything. Wait. The wall. There's another moon. That's a full moon. And we have a gear here that is doing nothing that will probably open that porthole right there. A lot of potions. Maybe a love potion, you know? That'd be fun. All right, goop machine. Um, we have our ornate glass jar. I'm guessing that's what it goes into. Yes, nailing this. All right, one, two, three. So one. The first symbol is like a ladybug. Where are you? There it is. So that's one. Uh, and then we'll fill up the jar with that. And then two is like the weird basketball type thing. More of a volleyball. Okay. Oh, uh, we have to do like one at a time. And I'm... Oh, crap. Shit. Okay, goop. Now I've got this, and I'm 100% sure that this is going into here. Oh, yeah. Fancy as shit. Basketball one is next. Purple. And in you go. Oh, this is actually pretty cool. We're doing alchemy. Which is a great profession. And what was number three? Three is the wheel. Got it. Gotta find... There it is. Whoa, a nice green. Got some slime. Everyone needs some slime in their potion. And in you go. Did that do anything? Oh! What? That is so bizarre. Uh, this go here? Okay. Whoa. That was really cool. That was really cool. A scratched looking glass. Whoa. What? Oh, that is really cool. Oh, look, the tree opens. And a looking glass? Oh, that is so neat. Anything else? Not that I can see. Let's go here first. Oh, I have to match up the symbols? Yeah. And then it causes it to come into reality. Cool. Ooh. Oh, there's like a picture in it that's coming toward me. That I have to... There we... Wait, no. How... How do I get it? Come closer. No, bring it forward. There we go. Wait, and then... Oh, we're so close. We're so close. It's like... Oh, I did it the hell is happening what is it showing me that's a person some sort of symbol that is a clue for something else that was really creepy so it's the box and then the three are outlined not the bottom one. Oh, that is really cool I right, match the symbols and suddenly, door. Wow. 
That is cool. There's no way to open it. What is this? Nothing. Interesting. What does that say? The void? Is that what that card says? Oh, that's creepy. I don't want to open that door. And then there is the tree here. Do 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 do. There it is. Oh, there's like a secret passage down the tree. Whoa! My mirror broke. Now it's a weird handle. A handle with geared ends. Can we go down the tree? Sure, why not? Oh, cool. Very spooky. Another letter. The old fool returned, peddling his contraptions. I take his lens not because I need it, but to continue the ruse. The Watcher can have it. Am I the Watcher? Is that what they're talking about? They are still blind and will need the sight if they are to complete our work. Yeah, I'm pretty blind, that's probably me. I know you are here, Watcher. This gift is only of use to those blind like yourself. Take this lens and follow. Alright, this witch is not really nice to me. She's kind of mean. I'm not that blind. Sometimes I can see. Oh, it's like really smoky. Alright, give me the lens. Checking out the box. She's looking at me. Oh. I'm just really glad she's not like an old crone or anything. Here we are. Oh, nope. There we go. Yep, it'll definitely just go right in my eyeball. Use the eyepiece. Yeah. Let's see what this smoke actually is, shall we? Ooh. Alright, the hell do I do with this? It's like a black hole in a star. Alright, I can grab this. Ooh. Do I have to go... So, okay, this... So that's like the ending spot. Got it. You have to connect all the stars. So something like that? That's not too difficult. Hell yeah! Who's blind now, witch? Alright? Voices. They say the door will open on a blood moon. Alright. Nice little vaginal shape there. Uh, we have three things here. Anything else in this tree? Oh, right, right, right. Um, I think it was... Okay, cool, cool, cool. And then you go down, and then it was everything but the bottom without going inside, right? So like that. Wow. This witch is fancy. So we have a new box in an ornate canister. Nothing on it but a picture of a flame. Is there a flame symbol somewhere that I missed? Anything here? Is this where the box goes, maybe, by the candles? No. Uh, was there a flame symbol on this? There is not. Darn it. Um... Wrong jar, so I'm guessing this jar goes here. And then... Oh, it drops crap in there. Like rocks. Oh, that's pretty neat. Ooh, look outside. Wait, does this change the actual moon out there? Oh, that is really cool. I really like that touch. That is neat. Okay, so I don't think these rocks are going to do anything because we don't know what order to do them in because of this box. Maybe if I dip it in here because it's really hot. Nope, that's not going to do it. What about the fire? Oh, there they are. We've got symbols. Oh man, I must have really good gloves on because I am just holding on to a burning hot piece of metal. Good, I'm glad I wore these. 
Okay, we have the symbol now. Um, I don't think there's any order to it. I don't see a one, two, or anything. So we're looking for a saw blade. There we go. Then we'll grab our box. And we'll fill it on up with some rocks. Special magic rocks. And then we dump the rocks into our potion. What are we making? Ooh, now it's a nice neon green. All right, the next one is, it's a wheel again. Looking for the wheel, there we go. And we're gonna drop that right into there. And a plop. Ooh. And the last symbol is the wavy beach ball. Looks like one of the balls from Final Fantasy X. Can't remember what that game was called, but looks like one of those things that Waka would use. I don't see it. Uh, okay. Maybe it needs me to use the goop instead. So that, because there's the thing, so we'll put some of that in there. Mmm, beautiful golden color. And dump. Ooh, yep, nailed it. Thank you, brain. What are you gonna give me? The hell is that? A door hand. Ooh, to the door. That makes sense. Click, and oh, do I want to open the door to the void? <sighs> <Ooh. laughs> no, 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 nope. Oh, this is shit. Shit, it's dark. It is so dark. Damn, letter, you freaked me out. All right, symbol of the moon, so we have to use the moon thing. You recognize this place, Watcher? No, nope, not a lot of features. He regards it as his domain, but like everything else, he stole it from his master. He has had many masters, and he has stolen many things. Together, we shall make him pay dearly for what he has done. The doorway is open. The ritual can begin. Is this like the knoll area that he's been taking me to? Where we're building that weird door? Can you please let me out of here? Oh, hey witch. Thank you. That's just a beautiful bright light. Anything else here? Alright, goodbye, the void. Oh. oh! I thought I was going to be locked out forever. Cool, not going back in there. So we have a box with this moon on it. Like right there. Yeah! Oh, whoop. Okay, cool, we got the symbols. There's a beetle. Uh, an anarchy sign, and this thing. So this one I know is here. I've seen it before. There it is. Grab our ornate container. Get some more of these special rocks and dump them into the brew. Perfection. Next up is, I don't know what the beetle is. I have not seen a beetle on any of these. Uh, the anarchy sign. I don't recall seeing this on here. So I'm guessing that is a goop. Anarchy sign, anarchy sign. There it is. And drop that into there. It's a pretty color, actually. I like that green. And in you go. Alright, so we're missing one ingredient, 
And it's a beetle. The hell do I get a beetle? Now there are these moon signs all over. I bet I have to do something with that. But I don't know what. What else do I have in my inventory? If I, oh wait, there were the um the candles down in the tree. So if I light this, can I go in the tree now? Yeah. Now we can light up the candles right here. Really? Nothing? Not even like a, hey, nice little secret. Did a great job. Uh, still have no idea what this is. Is there a beetle? Do I just reach in here? Oh, God. Uh, all right, it's not this. What else do I have? A handle with geared ends. Was there something I needed to do? Oh, right, this thing. There we go. Ooh. Oh, it's a beetle. It's a lot of beetles. Hey, Paul, it's me. You want to form a band? We can call it the Beatles. That was really bad. I apologize. Okay, do I just reach my hand into this? Oh, God. Ooh. Hello, little friend. That is just so creepy. Oh, hey, nope. Thought I would go into my inventory. Apparently, if I let them go, they just, they just fly away. All right, so we have to hold on to it. Ooh, or maybe I can shove it. All right, we're just going to hold on to the beetle then. And drop it in. No, no, you stupid... Mm. Do I have to hold it in? Oh, something popped up here. <laughs> oh, poor little guy. Oh, shit, it's one of the tendrils. Okay, maybe I shouldn't be helping this witch. Ah... Uh, but you know what, we're too late to turn now. I don't trust anyone. I don't trust anyone in this game. What is that? A key with lunar engravings. Huh. Now here's a moon shape, and I'm guessing this is where it is not. So there's something we need to do with this lunar key. It looks like actually that it opens up. There are like hinges on the side there. Lunar key. Well, I'm guessing we have to do something with the moon then. So... Oh, cool! <gasps> so the shape of the moon changes the shape of the key. That is so cool. I wish this was a real type of key. Although it would be very inconvenient to be locked out of things depending on the phase of the moon. Half a moon, half a moon, and we're in. All right, some sort of mirror. A crimson lens. Can't see anything through it. Kind of dirty though. All right, uh, there were other moon things around. Where, there was like a full moon one. Is it over here? Moon, moon, moon. Birdie. Moon, moon, moon. Ah, there it is. Oh, I need to get a full moon then. From here. Full moon, please. Oh, that is so cool. Thank you, Mr. Moon. And here we go. What is in here now? What is that? A crank handle? The hell is all this? I don't remember seeing anything for this. Because there's this thing that did nothing. Although it has the same... Okay. And then I'm guessing I need a crank. Oh, right. There's another moon right down here. It's just a small sliver like that. Oh, that's neat. And then that'll go there. And then I am guessing that is where our crank goes. Oh, I remember it. The, the text downstairs said that the door would open under a blood moon, hence why we have a crimson lens. 
Ooh, that is wicked. And now I'm guessing this will become... Oh, that is awesome. Now where the hell do I put this? I don't remember seeing any type of red moon key. Was it in the void? Do I have to go back into the void? Ah. Is there like a little moon key somewhere here? No, I'm getting the hell out of here. Um, oh, I'm an idiot. It's literally right on the box right there. The moon was hiding a gem all this time. A crimson gemstone. And that will go into the vaginal slot right here. Bye. I should have just saved that. That's probably worth so much money. Got another little puzzle ahead of us. What is this? I'm guessing I have to go through that? Oh. Oh, it turns... Hmm. So I just have to make sure that I go through those clusters of stars. Seems pretty easy. All right. Bye. Origins. Hey, that's the sarcophagus that we already opened. A tarot card. I hear voices. They say bring a relic from the beginning. Do we have to go back to the museum? Now this seems to be the spot where we put cards. Yep. Ten bucks says I open this door and it takes me back to the museum. Or not. <laughs> 